Welcome to Blender Quick Quick Tutorial Series. In this video, we will learn how to make the moving sine wave. So this is the file. Let's delete this cube. Delete the cube. I just move the X Y plane. So press Shift A. Let me show you my key keystrokes. Okay, now you can see my keystrokes. Press Shift A and uh, choose the curve uh, Bezier curve Bezier curve is here and G move it here okay press tab go to edit mode capture this by pressing G move here G and move here okay here press E move here and make the sine wave like this press e and move here and left mouse key again press e and make the complete sine wave like this how long you want to make okay finally by following same procedure i make this sine wave by using bezier curve so what's the next step exit from edit mode you can see this is the sine wave press shift a go to the cylinder to the cylinder right and just rotate this cylinder with the 90 degree because it's x y axis so if the axis is different maybe you don't need to rotate just scale it down scale into x axis uh, like here grab this and move it here and now what I need to do press ctrl R and first enter to the edit mode press ctrl R and move the mouse up cursor key that will divide this cylinder into small parts okay now press escape to exit from uh, the, this part and press tab to enter to object mode now what you need to do select this cylinder click to the modifier properties uh, you need to choose curve and here is the pen or the some selection option click on it you will now this is the pen option you need to click on the curve you see here you click on the curve this shape is not exactly signed because it's not exactly on this curve you just need to press G and move on the curve this cylinder I am moving down you see now you need to make sure it's exactly on the curve and I move let me scale it down a little like here and uh, S into X scale more down and I can see G into X and here you can see this is the sine wave right so if you want to move the sine wave what you need to do just go here and select the curve and uh, go to this object and you need to create the keyframes here click on the X and now you need to move like, uh, I move to 100 and now you select the curve press G and move it back like up to here and also create the keyframe so now if I run, let me move it here in the middle. If I run the simulation, now you can see. Uh, let me end it uh, because I choose up to 100, I select the 100. Now run the simulation. You can see. The sine wave is little going back. You need, can adjust the keyframe setting and you can play with this. It's, you can uh, make the sine wave. This is the quick way to how to make the sine wave moving sign wave uh, thanks for watching